what did you shoot? Uh, cotton tail. Rabbit. Rabbit. City rabbit. So we're gonna make some rabbit today. Here's a little quick rabbit recipe. I'm gonna cook a silly little rabbit. Do I look funny? Do I look slick? I think I look good. Not as good as a rabbit though. All right, so let's get off of me and uh, let's, let's cook a rabbit. All right, Max. We oh. A pan. Pan. P-A-N. P-A-N. Iron skillet. Let's get that bad boy hot. We just turned up the fire. All right. Okay, keep talking, man. Keep, keep the fun going. Um, olive oil. oil. So, there you go. By the way, I can't hear anything. A little olive oil. Get that, get a good amount on there because it really tastes good. It tastes, it tastes delicious. Okay. Then, start the rabbit. Peter Cottontail, he's not hopping down the rabbit trail anymore. Peter Cottontail is gonna take a bath right here. We wanna let this get hot first, so make sure it's skinned out real good. Oh, that's tasty stuff right there. Taste of riddles. Definitely gonna throw some garlic in this bad boy. Some minced garlic. And lock. And we're not gonna be shy with it. Good. We're definitely gonna need some parsley leaves. Pepper. Love time because we all got time to hunt. We all have time to hunt and we have time for time because time tastes good. It's time for cooking. And it's time to cook. All right, so now looking for oh, wait, some salt. A little pinch of that. Sun-dried tomatoes. All right, now. Oh yeah, cannot go without rosemary. What kind of party? Can you have if Rosemary's not invited? Not a big one, but you can still have a party. Good, now we got it hot, so we're gonna turn the fire down about medium. Okay, so we're gonna brown this rabbit. The reason why we're leaving all the bones in, flavor. Flavor. Come on now. Flavor. Our two next ingredients. Cream of chicken. Cream of celery. So we're gonna make a sauce with the rabbit and the white rice. Now we're forgetting something extremely important. Cabernet Savion. I prefer Merlot because it's a little more tart, a little more sugar. We'll use what we got. Oh yeah, and a little more for me. Ooh. 
Look at that. Okay. Flip it. Shooby dooby doo bop. Fiddly dee. It's a city rabbit. Okay, so we're key. Iron skillet. You do a slow cooker, cool. But this is a after we went hunting, let's just eat this dude. And and uh, yeah, it's still delicious because it's very fresh. Very, very fresh kill. It's only killed a couple hours ago, so let's eat it. All right, so the next step is the oven. So we're going to preheat the oven to, we're going to roast it at 375. Start. Okay. So you're going to need some half and half. Because what we're doing is making a little cream baked sauce in here. Now this thing is done. So a little jizzy jizzy jazz of that. Cream of celery. Cream of, oh, that was cream of chicken. This is cream of celery. I'm so sorry for my mistake, but here, here we go. Now, mind you, we can do this foo-foo, Northern California style, but we're not. We're doing it while we got in the kitchen, because that's how you do it. You kill it, you come home, you cook it, you eat it. Okay, we're gonna need a little more wine in here, because that's looking a little too light. All oh, the sauce going. Okay, so now what we have, the rabbit's browned. We've combined the celery, the cream of mushroom, our sun-dried tomatoes, our garlic, our thyme, our rosemary, and a couple of other surprise parsley spices. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, oven's almost hot, so we're gonna let this go on medium heat, and we're gonna put it in at 375. And we're going to cook it until it really cooks down on this rabbit is nice and tender. And we're going to throw it over a bed of rice. Okay, now we're ready for the oven at 375. Just going to put it on this bottom shelf here. Okay, we are now going to pull our nice rabbit sauce out of the pan. Here we go. We got our thick sauce here. Okay, so now we have the rabbit. Yeah, they didn't call it, did they? Yeah, you're going to have some. You want to be in the video? Come on, be in the video. Say something. It's going on YouTube. Hey, this is a what's in my purse video. Um, you need to get some rabbit in your purse. Here's my wallet and look at that. Dang. Here's some. I'm going to go in a haul. What? Um, this is for a car. <laughs> All right. Okay, so now we're back to the rice <laughs> and the sauce. We're gonna get this fun. rabbit in here. Uh, I'm saving the, like, the hey, yeah. down payment yeah. until I couldn't find it. Remember that pup and so pup here we go. We live in Fountain Valley. Remember pup, 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 rabbit, pup, rice, pup, and pup, sauce. Pup, pup, and pup. Let's eat. Are you going to eat some or what? Okay. Yeah. So you get off before a pie. So look, you want to go to the you guys don't want my rabbit? No, no, no. Rabbit. Oh, God, there's, there's good beef, actually. Did you chuck the onion in there? No onion. Is there any hair in it? No. Nope. Mm. 
Is it good? That's not bad. Pretty good, huh? I think that's my first rabbit. Is it? I don't think I've ever eaten rabbit. Good job, son. Well done. That's pretty good. It's weird. It tastes like I had my cans. What's usually the best part? Backstrap, like right here. Okay. Actually, all of it's good. Yeah, yeah. Right here? Yep, a little back strap right there. That's the tenderloin. See this? Oh, yeah, right there. Right there, the tenderloin. Oh, tender. There you go. It's delicious, huh? Mike's. Good job with the price, too. This is called Mike's. Hey, little Goopa. Hey, grandpa. You get duck hunting? Get the duckies. Which one? Pop it on five in You're going to go duck hunting with grandpa next year? Put you in a duffel bag and take you with us? <laughs> 